What's up, sports fans? It's your man D back again. Speak your mind, sports talk. Listen, boy, did it get exciting this weekend, man? The Golden State Warriors. Oh my, sweet guys, a sweet. Did anybody expect a sweep? Now, this makes the conversation a whole lot more interesting. Everybody's got to admit now, look, for a while there, I thought maybe, you know, might be a little shaky here. I'm trying to go and win the whole thing without KD. I mean, this is Kevin Durant, the best player in the league. I mean, come on. A sweep? Nobody expected a sweep without the best player in the league. Is it possible? Can the Golden State Warriors win the whole thing without Kevin Durant? Well, you know, some say he can, some say he can't. For the love of sports, let's talk about it. All right, so currently right now, I have one of our listeners that said he wasn't really too versed in basketball. Boxing is his thing. Well, hey, JP. Right now, you're our mastermind. Now, if anybody want to know who's the current mastermind and who's the champion, we're going to keep all of that on our discussions page. Uh, as we move along here and Speak Your Mind Sports Talk grows and, you know, I, we get a little better with our video work and we'll have certain things posted and we'll improve on that. But for now, you can find all of your information for who's the masterminds and who's the champions right in our discussion section. So... Congratulations, JB. JB is currently the mastermind. Now, remember, guys, we still have until Friday because the mastermind will not be final until Friday. So get in there, drop a comment, leave us an email, voice recording. Let's find out what your thoughts are. Can they win without Durant? Will they lose without Durant? What's it going to be? You know, after beating the Rockets, you know, everybody probably thought maybe, you know, oh, well, they got past the Rockets. The Rockets didn't play so well. They're still going to need Durant, though. They're going to have to get Durant to get through this whole thing. And then, and then, they sweep the Portland Trailblazers. Now, I expected them myself to beat the Portland Trailblazers. I didn't expect Dane Lillard and them to do it because Nurkic went down and, you know, it's kind of hard to lose a big man like that in a hole and still be the team like the Warriors with or without Durant. Because we have to remember now, the Golden State Warriors are still a great team even when Durant's hurt. I believe there's something like 32 and 4 without Durant. So that's something to think about. This means that these guys can still play basketball if Durant's not on the floor. And, you know, but this is the number one player in the game. And Milwaukee Bucks right now have arguably the number one player in the game as far as MVP race and so forth. And, you know, Giannis is a very, very exciting, strong player. Giannis is a very, very impactful player. Giannis is a beast. So will they need KD to get through Giannis? Will they be able to do it without getting through Giannis? I'm not sure. Maybe somebody can knock JB down off the top of the mountain. Congratulations again, JB. Can Durant come back and spring these guys into another title? A three-peat legacy for Durant? Can Durant come back and capture yet another finals MVP? Or Will Durant be hurt? Will he be out? Is it over? Is it over for him for the playoffs? We don't know yet because they haven't released. But the main question is, if Durant doesn't come back, can the Golden State Warriors win the whole thing without him? Can they beat Kawhi Leonard and the Toronto Raptors? Can they beat the Milwaukee Bucks? Giannis is a monster. Brooke Lopez is shooting better than anyone from the three-point line, percentage-wise. Chris Middleton is long, defensive. He's shooting lights out. Brogdon just came on shooting lights out. Can they do it? Are the Warriors strong enough without Kevin Durant to get through that Bucks team? 
Kawhi Leonard and that lockdown defense, Siakam and those guys, can they get past the Raptors without Kevin Durant? For the love of sports, let's talk about it.